Hurry up, guys. Burning daylight. What do you mean? It's on? It's on? No, no. Not about almonds. No, not about raw almonds. Just about. All right. No way. No, this is about the shaft. Welcome to the shaft, everyone. All right. So, what are we doing today? Got a nice bright sun. It's 58 degrees outside. Hot. We're starting to work into it. You know, uh, welcome to my brothers across the pond in the UK. Hello, Brazil. Hello, India. How you guys doing, man? COVID sucks. I get it. You know, got to wear a mask. Don't have to wear a mask. CDC says here in the United States, we ain't got to wear a mask anymore if you're vaccinated. I'm vaccinated. Wink, wink. You know, hey, you know, who's vaccinated? Who's not vaccinated? I don't know. You know, whatever. You know, gas prices going up. You know, Biden thinks he's doing great. I don't know what reality he's living in. I love it. You know, hey, jobs are going good. Yeah, even though the job market showed that we're tanking over here. And you know, these politicians, man, I don't know what, what reality they live in, but it's not my reality. I'm broke, broke, broke. That's why we're doing this, you guys. That's why we're doing this. I hope we get down this year. Hope we get into that shaft. We're going to do it. We're going to make it. But hey, if you can help us, help us, you know, subscribe to our channel, like us, leave some comments, give us some thumbs ups, no thumbs down. Don't talk about BYU either. It's okay. We're going to get a national championship. But anyways, welcome to the shaft. All right, what are we doing? Well, maybe we're doing, we're going to get a new uh, member of our team for transportation. Maybe. See this little Argo here? It's done pretty good for us, you know. But we're going to sell them. So hopefully this is going to be the art of the sale. I can sell these Argos today so we can buy, pick up a bigger rig. And I'll show you that rig if that does happen, but that's kind of the game plan. Uh, so, this is the art of the sale episode. Let's see if we can make it happen. I don't know. Uh, meanwhile, I did pick up the motor for the uh, crane. Uh, so I'll videotape a little bit of that, but uh, not on this episode, but I'll show you guys what we got to do. We got to get it ready to go. But uh, anyhow, you know, that's the life and the life of, uh, what are, geez, I'm brain dead today. Maybe I need more almonds. Who knows? But, uh, you know, uh, the life and times of a broke miner, you know, that's what it's all about. Uh, anyways, you know what, everyone, let's try to stay safe. You know, oh yeah, oh, whoa, can't forget what's going on over there in Israel, right? You know? Flipping Hamas, throwing 1,100 rockets over there. Whether you agree with me or don't agree with me, if I was the Hamas leader, I'd fire that rocket crew. You know, 1,100 rockets? Come on, man. Jeez, they haven't hardly done any damage. You know, it's embarrassing for those guys. You know, they need to be taken out. I hope Israel does their job, takes them all out. You know, all right, all right, all right. That's my political side of it. Some of you may or may not agree with me on that one. But, uh, you know, I'm from the Vietnam era. And uh, I didn't like, uh, you know, Hanoi Jane or uh, Jane Fonda. Put in, you know what? She should have been put up for treason for what she did. Yeah, I, you know, going taking pictures with the enemy like that. I mean, I'm a vet and uh, I don't go for that one bit. Don't go for it one bit. So anyways, that's just my take on those things. Uh, but anyways, welcome to the shaft and uh, let's get going. All right, Argo's all strapped up. We're on our way to Anchorage because uh, I got to take my Dodge to uh, my power wagon to the dealership. My AC's not working. And I know, I know, you know, you guys, you know, where it's 100 degrees and you guys are complaining how, how hot it is. I want you to know it's 58 degrees here and it's hot, hot. Anyhow, I wanted you guys to show you my front grill because they said a rock went through this grill 
and somehow or another damaged my condenser and they're not putting it under warranty even though I've got a lifetime warranty on this truck. Can you believe that? Look at that. Magic rock. I don't know how it did it, but it got through there. So we're taking it to another dealer and uh, we're going to find out. You know, dealerships don't like to do warranty work because their mechanics don't get paid crap for it. So they wanted to try to do it for, uh, you know, straight up money. $1,500 changed that condenser. Got news for you, not happening. Okay, Dason's gonna change it out for me. If he has to, he's not gonna like that, but he's gonna do it anyways. Okay, we're loaded up. <sighs> and uh, let's get on the road. Shaft. All right, Argo's on the trailer. Got to drive to Anchorage. Let's hope the guy in Anchorage is actually going to buy it. If not, well, you know what? I'm driving an Argo to Anchorage, driving it back home. But it's the art of the deal, right? We're trying to sell an Argo. Got to do what we got to do so we can get that big bombardier. We need a new team member. That's what this is all about. Let's get that bombardier. Remember, bombardier. But hey, got to sell stuff because remember, we're broke. So uh, help us out if you can. But meanwhile, we're loaded up, Argo's ready to go. So, uh, time to move on. All right. <laughs>